Right then, hope everyone's doing all right. Um, bit of a different video this week. Seeing as the Foden was so popular, uh, it's been one of the biggest videos I've put out for a while, I thought I ought to show you the other one. So this is down at the other yard. Um, if you've got two yards, you need two wreckers for moving tanks. So we didn't do much spannering this weekend, so I've just put a bit of a video together just to show what these Foden wreckers can do. So this is them shunting battle tanks around. Now bear in mind when you watch it, these tanks are upwards of 60 tonne and, and they move them like they're nothing and they sound good while they're doing it. So I'll cut to that. Um, if you could please, as usual, like, rate, subscribe, all that nonsense. Um, there's links to all the socials down below in the description and links to the Amazon shop with all the tool recommendations. Using all that sort of stuff does really help the channel. And if you feel like going a bit above and beyond, there is the link for the t-shirts down there as well. All much appreciated. Um, keep an eye on the channel as well, because we are starting the big project for this for this year. Um, I'm not going to quite disclose what that is. I'll be going to fetch the biggest bit of it on Saturday, and I will make a video of me fetching it and do the big grand reveal. Um, it's something that's going to be happening in my workshop for a change, so you get to see a bit more of that. But yeah, so that will all be coming... Well, I'll be doing it on Saturday, and then knowing how good I am at editing and uploading videos, you'll probably see it in about three months, or maybe on Sunday. It, it depends. But anyway, I'll shut up now and cut to the live action and some really nice food and noises. I'll see thee. Can it do it? Are we taking bets? No bother. No bother. I'd already loosened it. <laughs> it's the old ring piece. Ignore the leaking oil. Yeah. Click. Yeah, that's talk. Click. Job done. Brakes on this are mint. <laughs> See where I test painted it. Yeah. See where I test oh, painted yeah. it. A bit higher. Keep going. 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 Yeah. So nobody believe will believe it, but that went on in one go. Let me remove forklift. First go. You've dropped it in the ring piece before, haven't you? Mighty Foden. We shall remove four. 
so good at so good at starting this thing. It's just the wrong fuel. So yeah, the half's coming out. Oh, this is the other food and the tidy one. A bit better nick than the other. Bit of a babe. See how it goes pulling this thing out. bastard a bit more low tech on this end the best vehicle in the fleet going to be the best vehicle in the fleet Bob will still be my favourite You're not on. <laughs> I'm busy filming. I like how we've got the barrel lined up. So if you break suddenly and this carries on rolling, the barrel will go straight through your head. Very nicely done. We've got the safety certs for them, haven't we? Oh, yeah. Oh, this is a... Ah, oh, it's a safe way of doing it. I'll tell you what, standing by the exhaust quite nice.
Time to hide. When towing with chains, always hide behind something substantial. But after moving stuff with the Leyland, that thing is just unreal. Nothing is a bother to them. Not quite sure what that scent weighs, but it's got to be 50 odd ton. Can't even remember if the engine's still in it. Not a bother. Should we get them uh, that airframe off? Mighty fur. <laughs> what do I need to do, Seb? Uh, you nope. Up or down? Down. Down. That like a glove. I don't worry about it, I'll fix them after. Well, when I hit it with an amp, I don't worry about it. Oh, I got it on video that I fucked it. Well, then I'm admitting that one. I'll fix the threads and I'll send you a nice bill. <laughs> Nobody else ever does. Yeah, 20 of my clients watching these videos who owe me money. Pay your fucking bills. I don't employ me. <laughs> <laughs> Push them in, Dr drop it down, Matt, and then push them. Yeah. Whoa, whoa, stop, stop. Yeah, I know, but we're about to tip them off. I think they go into the sand. Did you know I've forgotten the pins? I've forgotten the pins, I left them over there. <laughs> We're getting this thing in now, we've got a bit of room. Just to get warming throughout the weather. <laughs> You've done some work. Yeah, for a change. I say we all have to do it once a week. Hey, where did you get cider? Out of the fridge. We've got cider in the fridge. Yeah, Fucking well. Hey, my cider. <laughs> it is now. The time for warming stuff to go in. Don't 
Don't you bugger the friends up again. Good old safety, Seb. We've got to thank uh, the British Railway companies for allowing Seb to be here today. Yeah, they are paying for it. Well, that's it. Well, no, they're not paying him. That's why he's on strike and that's why he can be here to help. <laughs> Yeah, we've, pull, we've pulled him away from burning pallets for a day. Greta would be most impressed. <laughs> Seb, yeah, because there's a burr on the other side of the nut. It's this way on that way. Got to let the railway. Make it do amend. Bodge. <laughs> Bodge it and scarf it. Like that ring piece. That's yeah, so that well machined. Good. It's like your ring piece, that is. Well reamed. Sorry about that, guys. Side down and let the team down. Not angry. Right, so we're going to get in the centre. I'm going to go commit suicide. Yeah. We wouldn't expect anything less from a communist, though, would we? That's going to film. Seb, if you take out the directions to relate to you, always remember to chop stuff up or grease off. Well, I'm going to film the carnage. I'm not going to tell anyone if it goes wrong because it makes for better YouTube. Useful, Matt, a little straight. 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 Save, you got a sledgehammer. You're gonna want the little. You're gonna want the proper man's hammer. You've hammered away at a hole before. How deep are they? Not very. <laughs> clear of that now. Like a glove. So what you need to do now is hit every thread with a hammer to remove any apron. I don't think you're allowed to remove them anymore. I'm touching nothing. <laughs> I've now got to find a lathe. I've now got to find a lathe with the right screw cutting gear just to make those pins. Bit of a fit.
give her some. Whoa, well, no, no. Come back, Joe. Put, put some weight on it, Adam, and come back. Is he. Look there. What? Let me go and get a sledgehammer. Thank you.